it looks like a little person. That's a frog. Two hundred twenty-five. My name is Gabby, welcome back to my channel. So today we're making a frog cake. Mm. Like the ones on Pinterest and TikTok, I'm so excited. My idea for today is two layers. And if, you know, we don't get the two layers, she's just going to be a little short, you know. But that's fine, we accept everything here. Okay, so with this out over here, spring foam pans, all the ingredients. Now I'm going to do the baking paper. It was at this moment that I wanted to quit. I'm going to do the baking paper to line your pans but basically because these are spring form pans all you have to do is grab a piece of baking paper that's like big enough like a slightly bigger than the thing put it in and then plant it wow ta-da doesn't that look bad now we can And then we can line the edges. Okay, now we've lined them. I'm gonna put them away now. Okay, so now I'm gonna get baking. So I got this big, big, big boy bowl in a medium sized bowl. Oh, I need another bowl. Are you serious? Fine. I mean, I guess I'll get another bowl. Alright, so flour, baking powder, and salt. You got one. Here's my baking powder. So here's one. I feel like this is full of but it's fine. And two. Alright, so we're whisking in this really small bowl. We'll just call this combat. We'll just set that to the side. And then now we're gonna use our bigger bowl, our big bowl, the one that I was excited about. So we need to do the sugar olive oil, add the milk, and then add the eggs one at a time, and then add the dry to the wet. Oh my gosh, why does it actually feel like that sad? That is a good description. This is what the sugar and egg mixture looks like. And that is the dry mixture. And then we're going to combine that with that. Okay, so all the eggs are like inside now. So I'm going to put the dry into the wet. So you're supposed to do it gradually, I suppose. So I'll do that. I'll over this, give it a whisk, and do a scrape. So now it's time to pour them into the, the pans, yes. And we're going to bake these for, okay, it says at 350 degrees, 3, 350 Fahrenheit, I don't know what that is. Hey Siri, what's 350 Fahrenheit to degrees Celsius? So like 180. They're in there, I got them in. Okay, so now I'm back and we're going to make the buttercream. So. It's like a very weird recipe because it's like you make this like roux thingy and then you like whip the butter and you put it in. So I made that earlier and now I'm gonna weigh the butter. Okay, so this is 220. Oh, you are very smart. Good job. Five grams of butter. So butter is pale. It's it's pale enough. But now I'm gonna start adding the roux in. Oh my gosh, it looks like a little person. Oh my gosh, I have the audacity to burn and not be cooked inside. Now, my buttercream has like chilled for about like 10 15 minutes. Now, I'm gonna dye all the different colors. So, you can see here, this is my cake. She's come out, she's come out of the pans. She's very, very skinny. You can see this one skinny like mate. So, we've got all these bowls so that I can dye all them different colors. So, we need one that is pink. Purple, green, light green, black slash brown because I don't have black. I'm gonna have to make it, and it might not come out black. Um, yellow, blue, and that's it. These two, and then separate some for the green, and then ice it, and then we're gonna do decorations and divide the rest of the frosting. I could level them, but I don't think I would. She was definitely thicker, and I did not know that. And then I'm gonna use my spatula. My, this isn't like those offset spatulas you see them in. It's like the janky silicone. And we're gonna frost. So we're gonna put a middle layer. You can like pipe or you can do this, which is what I'm doing. It looks like. Oh, please be good and line up well. Wow. 
That is so good. And then we're gonna dye it um, a light, lightish green. Okay, now that's green. The cakes are completely cool because they've been like cool for ages. So they've been making you know, the butter cream and all that kind of stuff. Okay, yeah, I think I'll just do the top. I'll do all the decorations on the top and then she'll just be happy. Okay, so colors are mixed. Um, cakes out of the fridge. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna use a Ferrero Rocher, Ferrero Rocher to like be the frog because I feel like it won't hold. So I kind of want the frog to like sit here and just be like, you know? Or maybe I should put it in the center and the frog can be in the center of attention. So I put it in a bag and piped it around to make the frog. Oh boy, I really hope this works out. Okay, so now I'm gonna add the eyes. <gasps> do you guys see that? That's a frog. Frog boy goes croak croak. Icing flowers are annoying to make. Look everyone, I made a river. Flow flow. Sprinkle sprinkle. Okay, so here it is. Okay, so now we're gonna cut the cake. Slice slice. <laughs> wow. A nice layer. Okay, I'm gonna eat it. Choo choo. What am I a train? It's good. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you next time. Bye! Yo, we made a frog cake and it slaps.